Okay, so I'm pretty much done now. I didn't show this step before, so I just want to show it right now. Uh, any of my cables that, you know, I have it all set up the way I want, I want to snip off any extra cable. I want to leave a little bit of cable, but any extra cable that's sort of hanging out here, let's just, let's just snip a little bit more of it off so, you know, it doesn't, you know, get in the way of anything and cause issues. You can tell this is almost a little frayed. I'm going to cut off that end piece right there. Just so it's not going to cause troubles later. And I'll put an end cap on my cables like this. And just, you know, just crimp it a little bit. You know, it doesn't need to be really harsh or anything. Just crimp that down. So I'll just stay on the end there. Okay, let's go ahead and put end caps on the brakes as well. These, these end caps just came with my... Uh, my brake cables, just like that, and let's do the front. Now, uh, I may have to adjust my brake still some more, uh, and my shifter some more, but we're pretty much done now. Okay. All right, looks pretty cool. I didn't mention this before either, but my uh, brake cable set came with these things called donuts. They'll help prevent the cable on the top tube here from rattling against the top tube. Uh, you could also just use some uh, something else on here like Velcro or something uh, to prevent that noise. All right, so now the last thing to do is to go ahead and weigh the bicycle. Let's see what it weighs. The bicycle weighs 22.52 pounds. All right, so this completes my one by bicycle build, LeMond Poprad one by nine speed drivetrain. Looks really cool. It's under 23 pounds, 32 millimeter tires. Um, uh, the old Shimano Sora crank, I haven't replaced the crank yet. I would sort of like to do that sometime, but uh, it's a really nice looking bike. Uh, I'm using right now, I'm using a down tube shifter right here, so it makes my cockpit up here look nice and, you know, nice and clean. Um, I might end up putting up a thumb shifter up here instead. I don't know yet. I really like the clean look to the bicycle though. And now I have nine speeds to uh, ride this with and to go maybe a little bit faster downhill. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to oil the chain.